say in November 14th in your yes. interview with HBO, you're not even a tennis fan. Not tennis fan, it's like basketball. So you didn't chase her, you followed her? No, I just, uh, uh, when I had time, I wanted to be close and express that my intention is positive, supportive, and I wanted to build a relation, not a, a relation with Martina, two, three nights in hotel, as like maybe what uh, somebody wanted, and said, look, I, I had a pr pretty good fun with the famous Martina Hingis record, number one was sleeping last night with me. That was not my intention. My intention was build a friendship, relation, and maybe from this relation can find later, uh, if she uh, really wants, we can make in marriage or like that. That's my plan, I, I, I'm honest, I'm saying what was planned. Okay. And in my plan, Mr. Cox, is nothing wrong. Okay. Accord and you've said that you love Martina Hingis. Yes, I love Martina Hingis. And she loves you. Uh, Martina Hingis, uh, I can't say like that, because, uh, uh, but uh, in some period of our relations, she, she expressed that, that she has some feelings to me. I can't say that she loves me, because we didn't have sex. Sex is one also uh, important part of the relation. I didn't want hurry with that, because I wanted to build this uh, relation normal way, and once when we get that, that needs to be to top of our relation. Is I never had sex. Did you ever, in all the time you were sending these faxes to IMG, to Octagon, yes. to Miss Hingis, did you ever get a fax back? No, I never got fax back. You never got a single no. fax back that no. said something like, stop sending me faxes? No. Never. You wanted to follow the judge's order. No. You didn't just say that? <laughs>